it's absolutely perfect. You really like the Oreo candy canes? I've never had those. Eventually I want to get a mix of good and bad candy and put it in like a little container and reach in at random and grab. Glitter Weasel, if you see something that's weird or like really, you know, good, weird, um, send me a link to it if you don't mind. Uh, Cause I want to really fill out like a whole thing of it. I think it'd be really cute. Can your science explain why I can hydrate. Hello, yes, no apparent yes, reason. It it's good to see you. Look at his little feet. Oh. Okay. Okay. I thought that crab was gonna get him in the gooch. Sushi. Get some sushi, Dave the Diver. So this is a game about catching fish and opening a sushi restaurant. He's drinking a root beer. <gasps> they do the credits early in this game. This boba tea is really good. Feng Cha boba tea. I don't know. Bunny, it is a taro uh, milk tea with a uh, cheese foam. I'm not sold on the cheese foam. I think I would rather do like the tiramisu foam. But it does add sort of a tanginess to it. The bunny, honestly, taro is so good. It's It reminds me of sweet potato. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. Well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. So where's the sushi at? <laughs> Don't rush yourself. Have a look around. You love sweet potato? Yeah. Look at this giant blue hole. Never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes, which means this could be an incredible business opportunity. What kind of business? Well, we could discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go on in. Hmm, I don't have good feelings about this. Sushi by the, okay. Let's go. I think I drank all of my tea. Alright, <clears throat> how about try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With shift, you can move quickly. Remember, this speeds up oxygen consumption. Okay, so... Going... Okay. Good, looks like your skills are intact. You, your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Now, let's practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, the dagger. Try using the dagger on a small fish. You can use the, the mouse key. Finally, you've, you haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then? Looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say three fish. Okay. 
Got it. I think that should get you back on track in no time. All right, come back up to the boat. Oh, I don't have a choice. I was going to stay down. I was going to do more. Oh, well. Okay, now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? Oh, for sure. The soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh, man, that's just the best. <laughs> well, listen up. I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has one skill that I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. <gasps> what is that? It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one of a kind sushi. Are those bananas on his shirt? I think they are. I think they're bananas. Hold on, okay. The sushi sold the sushi sold here is made from fresh fish caught with in the blue hole. Where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people would just go nuts for it? Yum, I'm already craving it. <laughs> I bet. So why don't you join in on this awesome venture as well as well? What do you say? I mean I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Nothing to worry about. The restaurant is all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? So I can eat as much sushi as I want? Yeah, sure. You have to pay, though. Can't wait to check it out. The sushi restaurant next to the Blue Hole. It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. I want to dive more. This is very cute. Hey, Bancho, are we all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. Oh, it's already finished. You, you? Ah, you're the fisherman Cobra was talking about. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. All right, anyways, it's nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. So you like sushi? I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy. Just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Hmm, just as mediocre as expected. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of the sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish, just like you. How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. My calling is be to bring this taste of Mother Nature to everyone. Hey, Mother Gamer, how are you doing? Oh no, what's happening? An, an earthquake? Hmm, the interior is really quite a mess. Yeah, it looks like we'll have to delay the opening. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. We'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. In this state? <laughs> It'll end the importance of a... Uh, in the end, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch seven more fish first. Oh, and the restaurant is going to be open only in the evening. Won't that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate pre preparation just to make a little more money? It is a chef's duty to prepare the best fashion best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on the whetstone. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. I guess we're doing that. I'm doing really well, Mom. How are you doing? Let me do a shout out. Mother Gamer. Y'all go give Mother Gamer a follow. Uh, absolutely. A wonderful, wonderful friend. Uh, a wonderful, kind person. Please go give a follow. I hope your New Year's is starting out on the right foot. Listen. <clears throat> it's both of us. I mean, I can give you... What is the thing? There's like a saying 
about, I can give you the water, but I can't make you water your own plants or something. It was deeper when I read about it. Okay, I need more of this drink. It's so good. Seems Boncho is really passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. I haven't seen Boncho so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. The incident? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. Well, anyways, we need more ingredients, so go and catch seven fish. Yes, let me, let me fish. Y'all, I'm glad Meat isn't here, because this is a game just about fishing. That is it. It's just about fishing. If it was deeper than I read about me when you try to quote something, yeah. It's true. Giant blue hole. That was my name in high school. This is so fun. What is this? New content, escape pod. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first as the calling process takes some time. How oh, fun. And a treasure chest? <gasps> what is that? A cheap Japanese sword? Critical depth. We gotta go up. <gasps> no, wait, no. Light emitting dough. Hello. Light emitting dough, how are you doing? We're catching fish for sushi. Some of them are very tiny. It's very cute and fun zesty, hello. Uh, excuse me. Crafty, Hi, Crafty! Good to see you. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it this time. Ooh. Yeah, but what if I got extra fish? Crafty, it's good to see you. You're doing well. You're doing some OBS work and crocheting. Hell yeah. Escape pod. <laughs> Look at him reading his little book. This game is so cute. Okay, I love this. I already love this game. All right, looks like he caught quite a few. At this rate, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. <laughs> My, my, would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? Look at that. Wrap up your day and get things ready. On the way, you'll only be able to... By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the oh, afternoon. Yeah. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner hours start. Okay. Real quick, I want to give shout-outs to Light Emitting Doe. You don't trust anyone who names themselves Cobra? I don't know. Y'all go follow Doe. Doe is absolutely wonderful. 
Um, I shouted out Doe, Mom, and Glitter Weasel so far. Uh, but I also, I just, oh, please go give follows. You were playing Tunic. How are you liking Tunic? And also, there was somebody else. I'm going to give Crafty another shout out because Crafty's shout out is kind of always just perpetually broken. Um, so I just need to do more. Just need to do more of those. Uh, go follow, go follow Crafty. <gasps> we can save the game. Oh, we can't. Okay, never mind. All right, sushi time. You need to get back into Tunic. Crafty, I feel like you and me both, every time there's a game mentioned, we're both like, we need to get back into it. <clears throat> oh wait, you answered me above? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. You're doing good. You took an unplanned nap today with the kitty after Kina. Oh, Kina is so fun too. I loved playing that game. Um, oh no, now I lost, uh, now I'm rushing to, uh, through work, bleary-eyed. Oh no! I'm so sorry. You know how they, yeah, they can go by fast sometimes. Tunic is super fun. You got to the first main boss and it really gave you a run for your money. Total rush and you beat them after like six tries? No, that's amazing. I don't think I, I don't think I even got to the first boss. I was like, no, this isn't for me. It's for some people, but not not me. I'm not one of those people. Um, but I think it's cute, and I like watching people play it. I just don't like playing it myself. All right. Boncho says, how are the preparations coming along? Oh, no, Dave says that. I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here, here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. What? I don't understand. Cobra told me there would be somebody to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do was cook. And who else is there for that but you? Wait, I've never worked at a restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. I did play Kina. Yeah, I beat it. You feel like my gameplay was the only stuff you saw? Aw. Um, what? Open the ingredients below. All right. Here, you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and other materials you have. By the way, for those of you just joining, we're opening a sushi restaurant by a place that has a big blue hole and fish from all over the world have like, like every day, the ecology of this hole changes. And so different fish appear from everywhere in the world. So you can get every kind of fish in this one area. And we're opening a sushi restaurant there. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Okay, cool. So we got... Show you how to register actual items to the menu. New recipes to be added from the menu before they can be sold to customers. So without spoilers, the resolution reuniting of the first section with the first spirit boss... Yeah, it's a really, really good game. I'm not sure if that was a question. Or if it was just like a, right, it's good. It's very good. It's very, very good. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier. So try registering that to the menu. Okay, so we add to the menu. That probably wasn't that hard. Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you have to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. There was no question, just do you remember that part? Yes, so vaguely. Fizzy Flask, hello, how are you? Sesti, will you give Fizzy Flask a shout out? Okay, <clears throat> you can enhance the flavor of dishes. So try it when you have enough ingredients. Y'all, please go follow Fizzy Flask. Fizzy Flask is a bedazzled Bunsen burner that shoots rainbow flames and sparkles. And then when you cut it off, it still sparkles a little bit before slowly fading out, but then it's still just as beautiful. 
Also, Fizzy has a channel point redeem where you can, it's tell me I'm pretty, and then Fizzy makes up something like that to tell to tell you. Um, and it's very funny. And it's I Now I do it back to Fizzy, which I hope is okay. You're just working? Well, I hope Dave the Diver will will show you out. I'm trying to learn this. This is, seems complex. Um, now use the ingredients you caught to fill out the menu. Okay. So then we add Sea Goldie. So we would need like three fish to enhance it. So that's probably for later. Oh, welcome back, Fizzy. I'm so sorry there are ads. I need to figure out the best way to still do that. I'm glad how slowly we push each other to come up with wilder and wilder compliments. It's very true. Oh, I just said I hope Dave the Diver will will help you out with uh, with work and, and keep you relaxed. This is in-game music. How long are you going to stand there talking? Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Hmm. Have you perhaps poured green tea before? No, only soft drinks, I think. I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Sometimes customers will order drinks. Five to pour the green tea just right, or is that S? That's S. Well, it wasn't done. Customers who drink green tea of a good or higher grade will pay more. As I expected, Boncho's green tea is quite something. That really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? Demanding as always, why don't you try serving him some food while you're at it? Come over to where I am and take this food. You can dash when serving food. Shift. <laughs> His face. Hello? You sent the package last week, you say. What in the world? Let me check on that. Cobra didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. Seems like such a waste to throw it away. <gasps> Cerise! First. Add souls. Add souls. Cerise. Ten. Look at you go. Hell yeah. You're back now. Uh, in game music. Yeah. It's really good. Uh, does Diver refer to Dive Bar? No. Uh, during the day, Dave, the character that's highlighted, is a diver and dives for the fish. Um, Bancho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Mm. Well, all right. Everything looks about ready. I haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kind of nervous. <laughs> Don't forget to press E after filling the menu for business to begin. Okay. They'll order from the menu. Don't forget to register dishes. Okay. We're open. Oh God. Oh God, okay. Oh, I'm out of stamina. I do like that the main character of this is, uh, is a little chubby guy. Oh, 
You won't be able to produce food if you run out of wasabi. Grind and refill the wasabi before it runs out. What do I do? Oh, W. up get their food oh my god okay oh we can refill the wasabi oh nope we're ready let's go huh this is what i'm talking about close for the day boncho sushi closed hey we did really w we did our best 33 I earned Artisan's Flame. Top sales are the Sea Goldie Sushi. Okay. I don't understand. Okay. Ooh, work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Try a little harder next time. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. <laughs> A man should not feel gratification from a simple com from simple compliments. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, all right. Mm -hmm. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. I don't know. I don't know that I like Bancho. PPL? Oh! <gasps> Um, okay. Just a normal day for FedEx.